Harry Josie has exhausted his bankability on reality television. Australian hunk Harry Josie has been a recognizable face on reality TV since he rose to prominence on Netflix's Too Hot to Handle Season 1. Josie began his reality TV career on the New Zealand show Heartbreak Island, but he rose to prominence after appearing on the famous Netflix dating show. His on-again, off-again relationship with Francesca Farago had supporters on edge. After a rocky relationship, the pair split in 2021, and the emphasis shifted away from the Australian native. Josie banked on the remnants of his reality TV popularity and threw himself into projects that would further act as a catalyst for his fame. He went on to star in a slew of reality TV shows, from game shows to dating shows and even dance competitions. His reality TV resume includes Match Me If You Can, Dancing with the Stars, Floor is Lava, and more recently, Perfect Match. He has also hosted podcasts Tap In with Harry Josie and, more recently, Boyfriend Material with Harry Josie, where he offers his two cents on dating and relationships. Harry Josie's public image has painted him as an F-boy and misogynist, which he sought to redeem himself for on Perfect Match Season 2. Unfortunately for him, he followed suit on his quintessential reality TV persona and ended up in a conundrum with Jessica Vestal and Melinda Berry, Melrose, and enraged fans of the popular reality dating show, further dragging him through the mud. It also didn't help when he shared that he'd been drunk through most of his time on the show. Josie has publicly stated that he wants to find true love, but with a constant pursuit of relationships in the public eye and his dirty laundry being aired repeatedly, it's probably time for him to hang up his reality TV laurels.